Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of The Hot Seat, a wireless design and development interview series where we talk about the latest wireless technologies, components, and design issues for the wireless design engineering community. Today we are speaking with Troy David, president of Keystone Electronics. Troy is a graduate of Boston University School of Management where he majored in production operations management. He has worked at Keystone for over 25 years, holding the positions of operations manager, vice president, and exec executive vice president. He has been president of Keystone since 2010. Troy is credited with leading Keystone Electronics Corp from a modest designer and manufacturer of interconnect components and electronic hardware to the global leader it is today. Can you provide us with some information on your latest line of surface mount enclosure coin cell contacts? We've been designing and manufacturing um, coin cell retainer contacts for many years. We actually were the first ones to have designed um, these low profile contacts. And the next generation of, of, of contacts were, uh, our latest idea was these SMT enclosure contacts, which are designed for self-contained compartments. Um, you'll see many of these being used in the industry. Um, that They vary from one manufacturer to, to another. And we've been able to um, design a standard line of contacts, which we feel uh, anybody that has this application can use. Um, and that's what we've done. So what are some of the unique features that separates them from similar products in the industry? Well, like I kind of mentioned, the standardization is important. Um, we've designed them to work with a range of uh, different cell diameters from 16 millimeter um, up to as large as 30 millimeter uh, coin cell uh, batteries. Um, we've used uh, phosphor bronze, which is a good conductor, as well as a gold plating, um, which can be used for medical applications to consumer electronics. Very reliable kind of um, materials and platings, which we feel very comfortable with. So what would you say then separates you from your competitors? In regards to the retainer contacts, again, we're we're the leader in there. We started designing these. We've been copied um, uh, many times, but we're constantly improving the product line and thinking of other ways that um, our customers can can uh, utilize our uh, our um, our engineering team. Um, I think what separates us is the engineering of, of of these products and the testing that we do. That our customers uh, can count on Keystone to give them a product that will work well in the field. What industry trends are most important for Keystone Electronics to consider um, during the design process and why? It's always the applications that are being used um, regarding um, profiles, I guess, and current and conductivities. Um, obviously, things um, low profile is, is obviously a very important um, uh, thing to a lot of different industries that we work with. Um, and the retainer contacts were, the original retainer contacts were the, the, the reason why we came out with them. This is even a lower profile because you're working within the, in the, in the unit um, to, to put the coin cell in as well as being able to remove it externally and not have to open up the entire product to get to replace the battery if needed. Um, so that's kind of the different option here is that now you can, we designed uh, these, these coin cell contacts where you can replace the install and replace the battery um, from outside of the unit uh, which can be used in a lot of different industries and applications. And can you share with us your predictions on future coin cell developments and any concerns you may have that involve the, decre the decrease in the need for coin cell products? Well the needs are going to be smaller and we've been, we have a line of button cell and coin cell con um, uh, retainers and, and holders the, the, the batteries are getting smaller um, in the medical industry as well. Um, the, the standard 2032 is obviously used the largest in, in the computer industry, um, um, telecommunications as well as um, 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 consumer electronics. Um, I see the needs increasing. Um, it's they're, they're, they're lithium batteries, which are great for uh, long lasting and they're obviously used everywhere. You can get them in any any store uh, locally. Um, so it's e easy to replace them. Uh, in the old days, <laughs> I don't want to age myself, but in the old days, you didn't, you weren't able to get coin cells so readily available. You had to go 
more to like a Radio Shack to get them. And now you can find these in in um, uh, drug stores and in um, uh, large chain drug stores and things like that. So um, the use is endless, and I, I don't see it ending in the near future. From a state of an industry perspective, can you tell us what keeps you up at night? Nothing really keeps me up at night regarding um, the industry and what we're doing. Um, we're 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 a company that is, is it prides itself in, in staying in touch with what the industry is doing, and we have the flexibility, um, the design team, the manufacturing, to really move like we have with what applications that OEMs need out there. So we're we're um, I never feel like there's a um, there's no light at the end of the tunnel for us because we're able to to um, uh, to be flexible to move with the the conditions of the marketplace. So. Um, you know, I'm not too concerned. The industry, I, I feel, is very strong right now. I think there's there's still good growth ahead. Um, electronics is is um, still a leading industry in the United States, and we're still leaders, you know, globally in our design capabilities. And Keystone prides itself in not only being a manufacturer, but being a design team that can work with OEMs to um, come up with um, high quality, cost effective solutions. And is there anything else, Troy, that you would like to add that you think is important for our viewers to know, especially about Keystone Electronics and maybe what we can expect from the company in the future? I think it's important them to know that we're not just a battery contact retainer manufacturer and designer. Um, we are we're a leader in that particular area, and we're strong in that, and we believe in in the growth in that particular segment of our of our business. But we. Uh, we have many other products that we do design and manufacture, spacers, standoffs, fuse clips, fuse holders, test points, terminals. Um, you know, we pride ourselves in being uh, the global leader in inter interconnect components and electronic hardware. And um, um, we do focus a lot on the battery applications because they do have to be presented so they, they know how they're used and the th different things we do. But we... Um, um, we have other things that we offer, and we do offer custom manufacturing solutions to work with uh, modifications to our current line of product. And um, you know, we're a customer service organization, so we, we we like to engineers to know that we're available to them to work on their uh, particular applications and and work with them. And um, you know, that's what we like to do. I would like to take the time to thank you, Troy, for joining us on today's episode. For WDD, I'm Megan Zimba, and I'll see you next time in the hot seat.